Hi, I'm Tyler. Welcome back to the Kioxia Innovation Lab. In this episode, we're going to talk about Kioxia's Value SaaS SSDs. The key to high performance is moving data, not just between servers, but actually inside the server. Data comes in through the network, is moved to RAM, CPU, and storage. So the CPUs are getting faster, the DDR5 interface is increased in speed, even server interfaces are increasing. The PCIe interface has gone from PCIe 4.0 to 5.0, and SAS has gone from 6 gig to 12 gig, and currently we're shipping 24 gigabit per second SAS. This lets you move data faster inside the server. One thing that's not increased is the SATA interface. The standard for SATA 3 at 6 gigabit per second was released in 2009. There's no roadmap and no plans to ever make faster SATA interfaces. However, there are many people that are still attaching SATA SSDs to their server, largely due to cost. However, this is a major bottleneck. 24 gig SAS drives are four times faster and they're available today. SATA is not natively built into most server motherboards. Almost all servers today have a SAS HBA or RAID card, which these SATA drives then connect to. So the server already has the performance of 12 or 24 gig SAS. Kioxia's Value SAS RM7 SSDs are designed to replace your SATA drives in your server at similar cost. This can give you double the storage throughput. In our lab, we've shown substantial improvements in application performance, which can impact your user experience. You can increase your database, exchange email, VMware vSAN, virtualized storage, or other workloads by replacing these SATA drives with Kioxia Value SAS SSDs. SATA is a dead interface. It will never get any faster, and it's slowing down your fast CPUs, memory, and video cards. But there is life beyond SATA SSDs. To get the most out of your servers, you need Kioxia Value SAS. Check out our white papers on kioxia.com like and subscribe to our channel for more info on how to increase your performance using fast Kioxia storage.